Rolling. Rolling. Rolling here on St. Andrew's Arc at 5024. Um, we've got a 322 expanded garage. We'll kind of take inside. They are staging that area. I'm going to take Justin in here in just a second. We're here, Explore 55 Plus Listings channel. Please subscribe. Don't miss a thing that's happening in these communities. We are looking for you to guess the price on this one before the end of the video. I'll, go, I'll run all over the stats right before we reveal it. Justin's going to guess. And let's see, what else can I tell you? There's descriptions about Royal Highlands, the community itself, and more information about this listing in the description below. So yep. click that button, all right? I like this floor plan. You do. So this I is do. a side entry like floor it. plan, right? So you have to yeah. come down this nice long, kind of private walkway. Yeah. This is a property that does have a wall, right? A shared wall. So just be careful. It's like a balance beam over here. Yep. Um, but yeah, so we're going we're gonna to enter in from the side. And this is an Edinburgh model. So I don't Edinburgh. think this might be our first Edinburgh together. I know. I walked in here. I was like, this doesn't feel familiar. Yeah, it is different. And I have sold them in the past. Um, but they are rare. Yeah. Yeah. So when you first come in, even though it's kind of a split bedroom floor yeah. plan because you're going to have the right, the primary suite is going to be out there in the back on the, on the golf course. And then your other two bedrooms are here. So you got this little foyer area that's tiled, a lot of carpeting in this home. I think this and the kitchen, uh, maybe the dinette are the only thing with tile. Oh, bathrooms, of course. So I guess I'll take you into the guest quarters first. Yeah. How about that? All right. So straight ahead. This is going to be um, your son is going to come up over in that area. This is going to be the bedroom that's kind of uh, on the other side of this wall is the garage. Mm -hmm. So this is a comfy bedroom. Good size. Not lots of natural light. Light and bright. I like the colors in here. Double bank of, cat, of um, closet. Sorry. There. Yeah, yeah, nice hey. guest. Yeah, nice guest. And, yep, and the guest bath. And that's got a tub with a shower, single cultured marble sink. Yep. Nice. And laundry room here, and then takes you right into the garage. Now, again, forgive us, right? I don't want my, my sellers to be angry, but what's good about this, I don't know, can you see anything? Okay, there we go. What's great about this, out front you had that triple bank of um, cute windows, nice long windows. That is either man cave, workshop, golf cart parking, whatever. And then you still have your standard two car garage yeah. on this side. So this is awesome. It's kind of a little false a facade outside. You don't yeah. even realize it, right? When you get inside, here it is. Okay. Now again, staging area because they're getting ready to move. If you're on the listing itself, you're gonna see that I've had this room scrubbed and I've had it uh, virtually staged. Justin did a great job with that, but you're getting to see it as it sits, which is just their staging area to get ready for the move. This is what happens. This is what live YouTube videos are, right? All right, so this is the formal dining. So when you first come in, yeah. this is kind of where you are. They've just got it set up. You know, obviously this gets used. I mean, I've already sat down and had a nice evening with these folks. And they did have this set up as an office area. And a lot of times that's what people do. Or the liquor cabinet goes here, mm -hmm. right? Great place to be able to come over and mix your cocktail. Yeah. yeah. But we're, our stager's been in. Beth Voss did a great job. Huge living room. I, this is what I love about this property. The kitchen overlooks the living room. Um, so you get that open concept feel. You have the private dining on the back side of the wall, should you want to do that for holidays and have, when you have families, family visiting. Um, but you always get these huge windows in this yeah. model, this Edinburgh model. And right? I mean high ceilings. Yes, very nice vaulted yeah. ceilings in here. Oh, also, yeah. just a great lot. Oh my gosh. Lot premium. That's it. So have you, you've golfed this course? Yeah. And you've got two separate lanai's. Let me yeah. show you that. Yeah, it's kind of unique, right? So you got a little one here, little lanai here. When you go outside, which I can take you out, 
Then you've got open patio out here. You can sit, sit right here and watch the golf take place before your eyes. A couple little hills. Um, remember your white stakes are your out of bounds markers. So if a ball does wander in, they're supposed to let it be. Of course, we're in our dry season. It's dry. Mm -hmm. Here. And then your sun is going to set in the west, so you're gonna, it's going to go in that direction. Are we going to hit the other one eye? Oh yeah, so I don't know if I'm unlocked over there. It's unlocked. It is? Yeah. Okay. So this is right off the, the massive. It's exactly. And barbecue grills there, the Barbie. I didn't check that one. Oh, it's unlocked. Okay, woo, it's unlocked. So yeah, this takes us right into our primary suite. I'll go back around and lock all those up. Um, this is big though, so you've got a sitting area here, a little reading nook. Again, the, we're, that's back into the yep. living room area. Large master suite, they've made a little table here, that's kind of cute, so if you wanted to put a little laptop on there. Double doors that take you into the ensuite. And then you have a huge, of course we've moved stuff out of the way again, um, huge walk-in closet here, linen closet on the back side of that door, soaker tub, which is nice, we call it a garden tub, dual vanities with the cultured marble, step-in shower. Um, now, let's talk about this glass here because you're kind of looking at your, the neighbors are right there. You can put a privacy glass. I ended up replacing all the windows in my house in a, and used privacy glass, but before I did that, I put up one of those like Home Depot films that kind of yeah. gives you the privacy but allows the light to still come through. And there's probably, yeah, there's a shade that does pull down. Yeah. We want you guys to see the natural light, but the shade pulls down for privacy as well. Nice. Okay? Yeah. So yeah, unique floor plan in the Edinburgh, the kitchen, you've got bar space here. so to be able to hang out, entertain, little dinette area here. You could raise this, have a high top, you know, whatever. And then it comes with the bisque colored, I think these are probably original appliances. Um, and the microwave. Oh, and a stainless microwave, so not bisque. 42 inch uppers though, so big upper cabinets. And the lowers, this is gonna be your pantry. I mean, for me, I'm a simple guy. I don't need much. This is this is plenty of use you know, it. Yeah, yep. Plenty of space, and I like the openness of it. I know. You know, because because yeah. the Opal is a similar square footage. Yep. Similar size in a sense, but this it feels it feels a lot bigger. Yeah. Just because the high ceilings and the kitchen isn't cut off, it's mm -hmm. you know. Right. Yeah, it works good for you because you're in the high sixes there. Yeah, tall, dark, and handsome. That's it, brother. <laughs> I look forward to these, these little meetups, you know? I'm just yeah. kidding. Your wife, your wife's gonna be like, okay, no more. <laughs> um, but you know what? There's some sort of a privacy glass above on those yeah. archy eyebrows or whatever you wanna call those types of windows. Um, not exactly what I'd probably use in the shower, but that's kind of the idea I'm talking yeah. about. Yeah. Yeah. And they probably do that because when the sun does go to set, there's probably some sun that comes through that window and that helps block some yeah. of it. Or it gives it, you know, the colored, uh, you know when you put those crystals up? Yeah. And the sun hits them, yeah, it's kind of neat. So yeah, I mean, this is, and then this loops back around into your formal dining room, so you've got the full circle going on here. Yeah. This one, you want to talk stats outside? Yeah, let's go okay. to stats. All right. So we are up on the hill up here on St. Andrew's Arc. You're gonna see that it continues to go down the street, right? Yeah. Across and behind is conservation area. Behind this house, obviously, we're a, a lot premium on the golf course. We've got concrete that takes you all the way to the front door, and then we've got the oversized garage. Some of the stats on this property, 1,808 square feet, three bedroom, two bath. It's got golf cart garage, lot premium. The roof on this, brand new, 2023, less than a year old. HVAC is a 2020, and we have an original water heater. Um, what else can I tell you? What else do you want to know? Pretty much you saw everything else. A lot of yeah. carpeting in the property um, and original cabinets and pretty much original appliances. I think the lot matters, it being a golf course lot. I think that's going to up it, plus it's a 3-2. New roof, you're going to have to replace the water heater. 
I'm gonna say 359. <laughs> You're getting so good at this. 369.9. Okay. We're ten, we're 10 high. Some room to negotiate in there, but great lot premium. And this house could be really spanky, right? Someone comes yeah. in, just puts a little L-O-V-E on it, puts their touches on it, and, um, and they're ready to go. They're gonna stay in Florida. They're Florida natives, pretty much. And, um, just looking to get closer to the work. They're still working, so yeah. we're not, they're not a retired couple. So this one's ready to go. Come and see us. Book your tour. Book an amenities tour here at Royal Highlands. We'll connect you with somebody. Just comment and uh, click the links below. We'll see you again next week. Nice.